this is the typical uh, way that we deal with cells or tissue uh, when we want to analyze them metabolically. So we take them all and we homogenize them, put it into some sort of uh, vial or other um, um, solvent, and then we do some sample cleanup to remove things we're not interested in, and then run uh, the analysis of LCMS. And this, this is a great tool, and I know lots of people that are doing great work with this, and we should not stop doing this at all, but um, it doesn't really give us information about where metabolites are localized in, for example, a brain tissue uh, here, as we can see, that has many different morphological regions, cellular regions that are specialized in different activities in the brain. And it also doesn't really tell us about the variability uh, between individual cells. So in uh, my research and my research group, uh, we are trying to um, work with, to develop techniques that can sort of complement the current uh, LCMS-based strategies. And one of the major techniques that we're using is called nanospray desorption electrospray ionization. Uh, and we're doing this for mass spectrometry imaging. Um, so um, I will tell. This is what I will talk about today. 